Go ahead, Beth. Well, I don't know why I'm going to keep crocodiles and the pigs will eat my garbage and the cows milk people and, well, the cows just give people milk and the chickens give people eggs and I'm going to have corn and veggies and fruits and I might even have some mud for the pigs. Some mud for the pigs. And why are you going to have all this? Because I just want to have it. You want to have for it? My for your farm. Because you're going to be a farmer when you grow up. Uh huh. What else are you going to be when you grow up? A mommy. And what else? An artist. An artist. An artist. So you're going to be a mommy artist farmer? A mommy artist vet farmer. Oh, that's right. A, a vet. You have to be a vet too, huh? Uh huh. So. How are you going to make money? By being a vet. Josh, I'm talking to Beth. A vet and selling my pictures by not copying people's pictures. What are your pictures going to be? I don't know. Are you going to paint or are you going to draw? Are you going to draw? I'm going to color paint and draw. Mm -hmm. And what are you going to color paint and draw pictures of? I don't know that yet. You don't know that yet? Maybe you're farming veterinarian animals. Yeah, I might draw that and me taking care of my kids, too. Well, how many kids are you going to have? Well, here's how many I want to have. Six. Six kids? I want to have three girls, three boys. Are their names going to be Gray, Marsha, Peter, Jan, Bobby, and Cindy? No. <laughs> Are they going to be the same ages as the Brady Bunch kids? Yes. Yes. I mean, their baby. I mean, I hope so. You hope so? What's your husband going to look like? That depends on who I marry. What Do you know what his name's going to be? I have no idea what his name is going to be. How old is he going to be? I have no idea. Where are you going to meet him? In the temple. You're going to meet him in the temple? That's, well, that's a... where I'm going to marry him, but I want to meet him, like... In Chinese? In the park or something like the... that. In the park or something like that? Well, not China. Why are you going to marry him? Because he's a good husband. What makes him a good husband? Well, he's the one who works for the money. We, and I also throw in along with my jobs. And that's it. And that's it. So you're going to marry him for his money? I'm not going to marry him for his money. I'm going to marry him so that, like, when I go out of town, he can take care of the kids. Oh, okay. That's why you're going to marry him? Because he's dependable and he has a job? Well, just because he's a good husband. Because he's a good husband. Okay. And, hmm... What are you going to make for dinner for your kids? It can't be the same thing every day. I'm going to have a menu like us. Oh, a menu like we have? And what's going to be on your menu? Pig, chicken, cow? I told you I'm not going to eat any of my animals. You're not going to eat your farm animals? I am not going to. Crocodile tail is pretty good, I hear. Not even the crocodiles. Oh, You're not going to eat your crocodiles that you have I on your tell, farm? Um, I'm the um, person who's Shh. making a movie a secret. Josh. Pasta salad and maybe spaghetti and... No. And... I don't know the rest.
rest. You don't know the rest. What about fart? <clears throat> Joshua, that was gross. <laughs> now you're going to pick your nose for us, too? <laughs> you know I'm going to put this video on the blog, right? Can you stop the video now? Yes. Anything else you want to say about what you're going to do when you grow up? No. no. Except for maybe that I'm going to be a veterinarian so I can help animals that are sick. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Well, say goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>